welcome in this video you will learn about one of our latest initiatives called seller id barcode stickers at flipkart we are constantly working towards enhancing seller experience in this effort we are now introducing the seller id barcodes with our safe e-commerce supply chain we ensure that all your products are returned to you safely however there can be situations wherein the shipments are lost in transit in the event of losing its identity this could happen due to poor quality shipping labels or damaged packaging such shipments are called orphan shipments therefore to ensure a smooth return process and to reduce shipments being orphaned or lost you are now required to make use of the seller id barcodes these are customized seller id barcodes given for a unique seller which needs to be printed and pasted on each shipment while processing the orders we believe that pasting the barcodes on the primary packaging will help us identify the shipment's origin details in case the secondary package or the shipping label is damaged now there are two methods to generate the seller id barcodes depending on the availability of a thermal printer at your disposal first method is if you do not own a printer you can reach out to your existing thermal label vendors or contact these flipkart authorized vendors to procure seller id barcodes in bulk or you can also purchase it from your local vendors these labels are in 50 mm by 25 mm size here are the vendor details for seller id barcode labels method 2 if you own a printer in this case first check whether you have the qz tray application installed in your computer or laptop if not search qz tray on the google search bar and click on the first link which is qz download this screen will open with a download link click on download to get the setup it can take up to 1 to 30 minutes to download depending on the internet connection speed After downloading the package, install the application. Installation will be self-guided by the tool. Let us now understand how to enable seller barcode on the seller dashboard. For this, go to manage profile, under settings click on view. Click on edit next to the seller barcode printing to enable seller barcode printing. After the seller barcode printing is enabled, select barcode printer and click on edit printer. Select yes enable thermal printing. Now under seller barcode printing click on edit to configure thermal printing. A new dialog box will open for the same. Select the thermal printer from the drop down. Now this will integrate the selected printer for the seller barcode label. After selecting the thermal printer select the right DPI of the printer. You will now have to choose either 203 or 300 DPI printer. depending on the dpi of the printer now go to the control panel of your computer click on devices and printers select the printer set in the seller dashboard for printing the shipping labels change the printer page setup from 50 mm into 20 mm please note this setting is only for the seller id labels now go to seller dashboard go to active orders and download the seller barcode Your thermal printer will start generating seller ID labels directly. Ensure to paste the generated labels on the products before applying the secondary packaging. We hope this feature will help you reduce your orphan orders and have a better seller experience on Flipkart. This will also ensure a decreased return rate and improved speed of delivery. Thank you and happy selling.